by Josh Kaplan for the GatewayPundit.com. DOJ launches review of anti-Trump FBI officials' role in Clinton email investigation. And yet another blow to Mueller's investigation into alleged Russian interference in the 2016 presidential election. The special counsel was forced to fire a top FBI agent after possible anti-Trump text messages were discovered. The New York Times reports the special counsel Robert S. Mueller III removed a top FBI agent from his investigation into Russian election meddling after the Justice Department's Inspector General began examining whether the agent had sent text messages that expressed anti-Trump political views, according to three people briefed on the matter. The agent, Peter Sturzak, is considered one of the most experienced and trusted FBI counterintelligence investigators. And then you tell me uh, why we should trust the FBI if this guy is considered one of the most experienced and trusted ones? Can you imagine what the corrupt ones are if these are the most experienced and trusted counterintelligence investigators? Give me a break. He helped lead the investigation into whether Hillary Clinton, ha <laughs> ha, here we go. He helped lead the investigation into whether Hillary Clinton mishandled classified information on her private email account and then played a major role in the investigation into links between President Trump's campaign and Russia. But Mr. Sturzak was reassigned this summer from Mr. Mueller's investigation to the FBI's Human Resources Department, where he has been stationed since. The people briefed on the case said the transfer followed the discovery of text messages in which Mr. Sturzak and a colleague reacted to news events like presidential debates in ways that could appear critical of Trump. In a statement to the New York Times, Sturzok's lawyer said, we are aware of the allegations and are taking any and all appropriate steps. In August, ABC News reporter reported that Sturzok quit Team Mueller for unknown reasons. You mean he was fired, right? Because he made it public. It's unclear why Sturzok stepped away uh, from Mueller's team of nearly two dozen lawyers, investigators, and administrative staff, Sturzak, who has spent much of his law enforcement career working counterintelligence cases, has been unanimously praised by government officials, all deep state operatives. How can you praise this idiot? Who spoke with ABC News in, in that is now uh, working for the FBI's Human Resources Division. They should be fired, not working for the Human Resources Division, reported Mike Levine. Now this, after new details uh, emerged about Sturzak's firing, the Washington Post revealed the Justice Department launched an investigation into communications between certain individuals. Details of the mystery probe will be revealed promptly upon completion of the review of them. Yeah, we can all feel rest assured, just like they he reviewed uh, Hillary Clinton's emails. Said the Justice Department, uh, yeah, late Saturday night we learned the Department of Justice has launched a review of Peter Sturzok's role in the Hillary Clinton email investigation. Fox News reports, Two senior Justice Department officials have confirmed to Fox News that the Department's Office of Inspector General is reviewing the role played in, Hil in the Hillary Clinton email investigation by Peter Sturzak, a former deputy advisor for counterintelligence at the FBI, who was removed from the staff of Special Counsel Robert Mueller III earlier this year after Mueller learned that Sturzak had exchanged anti-Trump texts with a colleague. A source close to the matter said the OIG uh, probe, which will examine Sturzok's role in a number of other politically sensitive cases, should be completed by very early next year. Like, in other words, it takes you that long to complete the investigation? How much investigation? Jesus. I mean, I'm sick and tired of this. 
He participated in the FBI's fateful interview with Hillary Clinton on July 2nd of 2016, just days before then, FBI Director James Comey announced he was declining to recommend prosecution of Mrs. Clinton in connection with her use of uh, as a Secretary of State of a private email server. Reacting to Sturzok's anti-Trump text, House Intelligence Committee Chairman Devin Nunez said, we now know why Sturzok was dismissed, why the FBI and DOJ refused to provide us this explanation, and at least one reason why they previously refused to make FBI Deputy Director Andrew McCabe available to the committee for an interview. But what is this? All of Mueller's appointees are anti-Trump. They're all compromised. So what is the point of firing him? It must be because he was behind the uh, investigation whether to um, uh, guarantee that uh, Clinton wouldn't, wouldn't be charged in her handling of the uh, private email uh, server. I mean, really? Give me a break here. Give me a break. They're all corrupt and they're scurrying around because word is getting out. That's why Mueller had to fire him because I guess it was made known to the public that he was so anti-Trump. And he was behind Clinton's email investigation uh, and they call him what? Uh, they, I can't find the part where they call him uh, most experienced and trusted. FBI counterintelligence investigators. So, in other words, user, they're all corrupt. So, who? what are you talking about uh, most respected and trusted? He let Hillary off. He was the one that told uh, uh, Comey, you better let her off with uh, Loretta Lynch. They're all involved. I mean, it, it's disgraceful. All of Mueller's appointees are against Trump. They're all anti-Trump. So, what's in particular to him? because he's probably uh, uh, linked to getting Hillary off for her use of the private email server. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And again, thank you so much for watching.